Hello, I'm Richard from Daily's Walk Behind Tractors. I have a Caravaggi Bio 150 chipper. It's the larger chipper shredder that we sell. We sell a Bio 80, the Bio 100, and the Bio 150. Uh, the 150 being the largest. You can tell, if you've seen some of our videos, we have one on the Bio 80, we have one on the Bio 100. This thing's substantially bigger, really large. Um, so it's the fastest chipper shredder uh, we, we sell and also well fastest at chipping and shredding um, so we're gonna do i've got um, a customer's g131 grillo tractor with an 18 horsepower engine on it so i figured we'd run it on there and see how it does with the extra horsepower most folks are run, used to running them on bcs 853s or, or, or the grillo similar machine with 13 horsepower or under um, so it's got a, hand, uh, a stack of stuff here that we can ship uh, but couple of nice things, one really nice thing about the 150 model. The 80 is similar, although the mechanism works a little differently. If you're doing wet materials shredding through the shredder chamber, which is over here, this being a chipper, a chipper chamber, uh, and you get a clog, or even if you had a clog and you were chipping stuff, you can easily open a discharge screen. You can loosen this up right here, and then you just, bam, screen's open. Not that you can see that, but up underneath here where the flap is, now the discharge screen is open and clog can be dealt with really easy. The 100 model, you can't do that. Oh, well, not as quick. It's got a, a rod. You pull a cotter pin, pull the rod out, screen drops down, so it's, you can still, still do it, just not as fast. This clean-out lever is really nice. Uh, as you can see, it's got large, um, solid uh, caster wheels. This thing is really big and really heavy. Uh, getting closer to 300 pounds in weight, and uh, really depends on what you're doing what your application is, I mean, how much material and how fast you need to get done as to which one you choose. I personally prefer the smallest model, but I'm not doing a massive amount of chipping um, all the time that I need such speed, but I, I um, but anyway, you call and, uh, you know, I can discuss, you know, why this model versus that model with you, if you're interested in chipper shredders. Then we, of course, also have the Bio 90 high-speed chipper, which is a straight chipper, two blades, and it chips super fast faster than any of the chipper shredder combination units. So anyway, uh, all right, let's ship some stuff and uh, have a look. Thanks for watching.
guess we chip for about 10 minutes or so, however long the video is, uh, which I don't know yet because I haven't finished and posted it. But uh, it's a pretty big pile of mulch. A couple of my boys sitting on it there. So that's a lot of mulch in short order. So I, I wasn't doing the thickest limbs through this, but I had several that were that were pretty thick. Um, definitely a couple of inches, I think. And uh, one thing I noticed about running it on on this machine, and partly it's probably going to be the engine, and part of it's just the bigger chipper, but. Uh, the engine didn't really bog down much at all. I mean, one or two of the thicker limbs, maybe the, I noticed the tiniest bit, but um, so you need a heavy duty chipper and uh, you want a whole lot of power to chip with and then you can certainly uh, check out the Grillo G131. Most folks don't go that route though because it's, you know, it's a more specialized machine and rotating handlebars from front to rear mount position takes longer and and such. That being said, I own one and I like it a lot, but I also do own other ones today. So, uh, the main point of this video was just show the Bio 150 in action. And yeah, a pretty nice pile of mulch there that we can utilize. So, uh, thanks for watching. Hopefully, uh, we'll have some time to get some more videos going. I haven't had many lately. So, take care and God bless. Bye.